Okay, so here we are inside this 2013 Chevrolet Equinox off our used lot. Just came in on fresh trade. So here we are you at the home screen. Um, it doesn't matter what system you use, there's always going to be a basic home screen for you to find, whether it's, you know, the Chevrolet MyLink system such as this one or Buick Intel Link GM C Intel Link or the Cadillac Q system um, I looked into some of the Ford products too they basically all have a home screen for you and so today I just want to teach you how to navigate through your touch screen when you're first learning this um, so bear with me here so um, this is where you'll find your different radio um, bands like AM FM or XM radio bands um, on the Chevrolet MyLink you can see here CD USB auxiliary um, the quick info and the Bluetooth options as well so let's just hit more because um, there was more to it um, there's a section where you can go back to what you were playing on the radio first um, before you know, navigating away, you can tone, configuration, your pictures, your phone, you can set up something with your phone, and then this is where also any of your other apps that you've put into your vehicle, this is where you're going to find them. Um, so, you know, let's just go to FM. So here you can see we have obviously the radio here. Um, let's go... You know, this is where, you know, your XM radio, you can select that way, you can go back or home at this point, you can hit the AM button, so, and that would give you your AM radio, let's just pick that, turn that down, okay, so let's hit the home button again, let's go explore, um, let's see, you know, if you had minutes on your phone, you could go like that, and so, um, you can either enter a number of who you're going to call or your phone settings. Okay, well, we've hit pair device. So let's just see what we can find here. So we're going to take a Samsung Galaxy um, S5 here. And we're just going to um, find... Okay, so Bluetooth. So we've hit the Bluetooth button, it's ready, um, and so it's scanning right now, right for you. Um, it's still scanning. Please, yeah, so we have a Chevy Equinox right here, so let's pair that up right there. <laughs> Confirm key pass is... Yes, so we have that key code here and that also on the other screen. They're both the same. You can just hit OK. And so it's going to connect to that Chevrolet Equinox. So um, what we can now do, let's just hit a, oh, here, let me, let's go back. Um, so we're going to hit this. OK, so let's just make a call here. We'll call myself, actually just to see how this goes. Oh, it's dialing. See, and now you can see the telephone is calling me, so let's just actually hang up on that. And so, you reached the mailbox. Hang up. <laughs> so, you can definitely use your your phone um, through your vehicle system when you're using the Chevrolet MyLink or the Buick Intel Link, the GMC Intel Link, or the Cadillac Q system. You can definitely use that for your safety on the road and for the people around you. All right, well, thank you so much for coming along on my tutorial on how to use some of the basic functions of your touch screen in your new vehicle. Um, if you have any more questions, how-to questions, any more questions about any of the technology in your vehicle, definitely feel free to let me know. Um, I'd like to do a video for them and for you, because if you're wondering the question, somebody else is also wondering it also. So you can reach me at B S L. 
A-G-E-R at keyshev.com. Thank you.